J O H N S O N. Just follow him, all right? Johnson. We're here with the kids. Ladies and gentlemen, we're trying to get her to five thousand. Go ahead and toss her a like, toss her a couple of follows. Just a double tap. Yeah. <laughs> My thumbs. Oh, uh, we're ready. Take go three. Ahead, go ahead Take three. Go ahead with your intro. You know, I pay my editor by the hour, so like the more you guys fuck up, the more the more content. Yeah, you know? the more you have to pay him. You know, Connor, right, we're working for you, buddy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, that's not how it works. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the more, the better you do, the more money he makes. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, come on, take seven. Don't you tell me to come on. This is my world. You're in my world now. More in my world. Little Chi-Chi. Ladies and gentlemen, Salam. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Salam Mike. Back again, we filmed this. We talked, we had an hour long chat and it was golden. But was good. you know how YouTube works, maybe you don't. Life works, technology is, is a blessing and a curse and we lost it. So we're gonna slam back in on Instagram questions that you guys gave us, my friends. Lil Lindsay, strong, strong chick, normal life, a little bit outside fitness, still in fitness, great perspective. Bontro, she's in fitness, coach, powerlifter, extraordinaire. Is so fitness. she's, a, yeah, <laughs> she, 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 she is the epitome of athleticism, <laughs> vicious, aggressive powerlifter. So watch out for her, we're gonna dig on in. <laughs> what, dude? Nothing, dude, nothing. Just, just here. Favorite superhero? Star Captain basic. America. Oh, Batman. Are, oh, these, based, are these based on like, <clears throat> I like Christian Bale, that's my favorite movie, no. or is that based on like the character, what he represents, no, what he does? No, I Batman, but just because he doesn't really have any, any superpowers. Okay. He bought his Captain America. Well, his well, shield. He got yeah, to, and the best steroids a man could buy. Yeah, I mean, yeah. hey, which hey. I mean, Batman's probably using too. But like, he, I think they're all probably using their super yeah, heroes. Their Look, super I bet they're actually none are using because they're not but, real. But <laughs> you know, he wasn't like fucking bit by some radioactive spider. He just like worked his ass off and he trained. So, That's so I'm gonna knock both of yours down. Uh, so, fine. look, Batman. We're done. Batman bought his way to the top. He's basically a trust fund baby. That's fine. You don't mind trust fund babies. No. I don't think I do. And your guy's sauce, I'm a, I'm, I'm sauce to trust. the goddamn gills, and he's I'm, <laughs> he. I mean, he wears red, white, and blue. Represents the U.S. Look, of A. Look, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Right, I, well, I love the opportunities I got here. I, I don't know what else you want from me. All right, dude. I don't well, know. Who who's my, yours? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. You're just know. gonna knock us both down. Yeah, I like them all. Nothing. <laughs> I like them all. So the issue is, is I can't detach it from the series that I watched. So sure. when I was a kid, I watched Spider-Man, the cartoon in the '90s. That's so I fair. love that because I, I like that cartoon. Never into Spider-Man. But I, I'm yeah. not. I don't like Spider-Man now. I like that cartoon. And sure. same thing. With, I got really into Batman because I love the, the the trilogy with Christian Bale. Sure. Uh, I like. I kind of like uh, now. I understand that. How it's hard to separate it. I get it. Now, if I had to say, as a hero, I don't even like him. Iron Man. I think it's kind of dumb. But Tony Stark in the latest movies is my favorite character. I love that he's witty. Yeah. That is kind of sassy. Yeah. yeah, for sure. Can we go Deadpool? Deadpool is a great Can movie too. Deadpool? I would never like Deadpool yeah. as a comic, but I like Ryan Reynolds. I, I mean, like it's the hilarious. Movies. It's a one, that's what I mean. It's I like the movie. A, yeah. I don't know if I like the yeah. superhero. Yeah. Wolverine. I, uh, if I had to choose a superhero, it might be Wolverine. Oof. Whoa. Yeah. Wolf. Oof. Wolf. He is a hard. Sometimes wolf that's the only. That's a response. yikes for me, dog. <laughs> that's a big yikes for me, dog. <laughs> Oof. Next question. Oof. All right. This is good. You guys got to throw down though. Are you guys in this or are you just kind of in this? No, I'm in it. Right. Bonk. To win it. Yeah. Uh -oh. Who can rap a better freestyle? Oh, <laughs> oh There's no, there's no, no way. No, no. way it would be me. You can. You would win. You, you would win for sure. I can barely speak. <laughs> I can't even rhyme. I'll just take like, the dub. I'll just take the dub. We'll yeah, we're on. not. We'll just take, this we is can't. a, no. Nope. Also, I feel like you. Huh? <laughs> Oh, excuse oh, me. Which question? Okay. Huh? Or, or don't. No, I don't know what you mean. Oh, okay. Is what? there is there something going on between you guys? No, get out of here. <laughs> yeah, there's how many questions? Like, you put a girl on the internet. You guys know this. If, if you're above the age of 15, you understand. You put a girl on the internet with you, and everyone automatically thinks that, as the kids would say, smashing or dating. And smashing. Not smashing. Damn. Um, but this is this is semi-related but unrelated, and I think maybe something if you guys would honest uh, try to answer honestly. I think it is. Uh, a, a little bit of a, a weird question because it doesn't matter as much because it's not a different type of human but basically they're asking is how to get a fit chick and I think how to get uh, you know a date or how to get your crush to like you uh, is almost the same because a fit chick isn't a different type of species right like no, it, right, it, yeah. it, it's still human we're so all, we're all right uh, living breathing <laughs> that's just r2d2 our washer don't mind those beeps guys he's just he did his job and now he's letting us know he's well, letting us know <laughs> how to get a fit chick that's tough. I don't know. Don't be a douchebag. Um, <clears throat> it's a good start. Right? Don't be a douchebag. Right? Don't be a douchebag. 
Give um, us a little definition of that, though. Because people say they can't, don't be a fuck boy. I mean, I guess it depends on. I don't know, Bonnie. No, oh, why do I just go over? Um, I mean, don't don't be a a creep when you slide in her DMs. Or maybe just don't that, slide in her DMs. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, but maybe maybe tell I mean, them what maybe, not to do. That's a maybe, good start. Maybe like yeah, maybe be, don't do be personable. Have but a conversation. But you know what? Like DMs could be fine. Like I get it. Like it's yeah. a way to communicate. Like I, I get, get it. it. I get it. Um, but I think that if if you're not creepy, that's a good start. If you're if you like be confident. That's good. Or like, like what if, what confident. if you go back to like trying to be Fucking, with a fit chick about, in your gym? How about make her laugh? Oh, because I appreciate a sense of humor. How about hold her hand? How about hold her hand? How about hold her hand? Yeah. I think you guys holding hands is a little step further. Oh. These poor kids are just gonna run to the gym and grab a hot. Yeah. Pack. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, yeah. but I mean, if, I think if you're trying to get a fit chick that's like in person at your <clears> gym, <throat> like there are different ways to approach it than like don't be across the gym like grunting, screaming, throwing weight around to get her attention. Also, I think you have to look right? at like what is different about getting a normal chick versus getting getting a fit chick. Like, what yeah. would you do so, if you were at work trying to pick up a, a girl? Look, I'm not I'm not hitch or anything, but maybe we just start with a hello and be a normal goddamn human. Yeah. Just be yeah. a normal goddamn human for yeah. a little yeah. bit. Yeah. I mean I think I think if 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 you're trying to get like an, an athlete, a woman who's an athlete. An athlete. You need we went you from there. Fit chick to well, I I don't that seems like a separate yeah, yeah, yeah. It seems like a separate thing, right? Yeah. But as as a female athlete, I would want to I would want that to be respected. Right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you would want yeah. a man to compliment you. Is it, oh, you're from shop, right? Hey, have not, a, not, oh, you're strong for a girl. Of those Gymshark leggings on you. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, yeah. fair. Yeah, right. And they're respectful. Mutual respect. Yes. I think yes. a lot of it. It just all starts with that. I think a lot of people get nervous dealing with talking to the opposite sex, but a lot of it's just like logical and natural if you allow it to happen, right? Sure. Like, just communication, just maybe be funny. Maybe being. be nice. Maybe be time. nice. You know, weird. maybe give them attention, maybe seek attention, don't be weird, don't. If you figure it out, teach my Mike 101. Look, I've watched- <laughs> How to get a fit chick 101. I've watched Hitch like 10 times. Aww. I could basically write a book. That's a great movie. Will Smith. It's a good movie. You yeah, don't think it's a good movie? movie? Yeah. It is a good movie. Yeah, it's a good I movie. Like I don't think it's the best for dating advice, but it was a joke, yeah. kiddos, but I think it's a good movie. Um, oh, the booty king. <laughs> How can we get your sex, sex appeal? Is that how you spell sex appeal? Sexa, appeal? Where, sexa. Let me see it. S e x a. No. Oh, I love no. it. I like that though. You got to add an extra word. p. Yeah, that's cute. Uh, like yours. Look, look. <coughs> I appreciate that. I, I, I am the peach king. I am charming beyond all charm. Sex appeal. I don't know if I have it. You know, you I don't know. You're a modern mullet. What do you mean you don't have it? Look, I. You know what I'm good I mean, at? You know what I'm good at? You know what I'm best at? What? Being me. Touché. I'm best at being me. I, I stick to my guns. I've been me for a long time. Don't plan on changing. Look, look, pal. If you think that's sexy, thank you. But I, I don't have sex appeal. What are some tips for beginning lifters? You're kind of a beginner lifter in my head. Mm. Yeah, I am. I am still in the beginning lifting phase. Um, I mean, how how cliche? Consistency is key, right? Like, don't give up just because it gets hard. Um, I think I had a rough time with comparing myself to the people that are already. Yeah, you know, yeah. way up there, and day by day. I think that's really I'm, bust your I think ass. That's hard, right? At, no matter what level you're at, is the comparison thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. I think that I think that never fully goes away, but I think you just learn how to handle it better. Listen, as you like mature and grow as a lifter, get a coach. I don't just say this because she's sitting next to me, <laughs> but for real, the best thing I did for myself as a beginning lifter was to get a coach. Yeah, yeah. and, that's and somebody that yeah. knows what they're doing, not not. You know, bodybuilding.com. I don't know. Somebody that That's rude. Can... I've been featured no, on there a no, lot. No, no, That's somebody, <laughs> all right. Somebody that you can What other What other with. daggers you got? You want to throw no, over here? You know what I mean? Like, not find not a just, better YouTube channel. Shut up. I don't... Shut up. Don't just go print off a 12 week program that yeah. you've got to fight through yourself. Yeah, yeah. You know, have somebody that you can text and say, hey, you know, my squat's trash. Fix it. Yeah. You know, watch these videos. Help me out. And if you have a coach, you've got to put in the same amount of work that they're putting in for you. I don't know. Yeah. That's that's the best advice I think. Honestly, yeah. I could give a beginning lifter. Scott Bonds. I think uh, just learn all you can, and that kind of goes throughout your career as a lifter. You know, never assume that you know everything or that you know the best way to do something. Um, I think uh, staying humble will get you pretty far as an athlete and as a coach. Um, but yeah, just learning all you can and really becoming just a student of the sport I think is important. Yeah, I can. Uh can't really add much. I've talked a lot about both of those in the past. Uh, getting a coach online, you know, it's, it's hard because in, in person and online now, 
there's so many options and so many qualified and, and experienced coaches and so many not so, so it is hard to filter through, but uh, don't be afraid to interview your coach a little bit, just ask them questions. Uh, and how much they bench is probably not the best question to ask, but there's there's <laughs> some things you can figure out. Um, and then on-, well, on if it doesn't work, don't be afraid to find somebody else either. Yeah, 100%, yeah, no, yeah. You're, I, not always, you're not always gonna end up with the coach that's perfect for you the first time around. And coaches gotta chill a little bit too, because they get all personal when people leave. Like, that's how life goes. Um, and what was Bond's point? Uh, oh, learn. student of the sport. Yeah. Yo. Look, it's very common now for, for bigger, smaller, medium lifters and coaches to, to try to find a click, try to find a cold. I'm this type of lifter. I use this type of programming, but I can't agree more. If, if you want to be uh, an expert in a category, if you want to be uh, the best coach or best even athlete you can be, you have to learn from a variety of types of people, different styles. There's always something you can pick up uh, and the history of the game. Yeah. All these questions are about my butt. What are they asking? Uh, they asked who's thicker, how can I be a thick boy, how do I get a booty like Mike, tips for cutting. Oh. These two are little, they're little and jacked. We've, I've never had to cut a ton. They've never been fat in their life. Mm -hmm. My way in light, I'm trying to eat my way into my weight class. Yeah, we've got one that's <laughs> trying to bulk and I never worry about cutting more than like, cutting more than like three pounds. Weight so. classes are arbitrary. Ladies and gentlemen, like we said, just a casual, loose. Q&A with two of my friends, strong friends. Check them out. Instagram's below. Lindsey Johnson. Bon Shro. Bon Shro. Well, you say bro Shro all the time. <laughs> it's bro Shro. There's no, an extra R in there. But you say that and then they're not going to be able to no, find it's, her. Bon no, they've already found her. Yeah, you perverts. You guys are hacking the mainframe. <laughs> Ones and zeros is all you guys see. Appreciate you. New videos dropping Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday, Sunday. We got some vlogs. We got some food. Please do me a favor. Check out the new series. Uh, food dropping a lot. So we got the in and out versus five guys. Check it out. Give it a thumbs up. Go tell your mom about it. She's going to think I'm cute. And then this thing's going to go viral. I appreciate you selling my come out. <laughs> oh, you're so good at what you do, Mikey. Ouch. <laughs>